Hi everyone. Well, it's happened. My iPad has had an argument with iMovies and it hasn't downloaded the first part of the video that I've just been editing. So um, this is the introduction. I hope you enjoy the movie and I want to wish you all Happy Easter. Thank you. Bye bye. It's called Hydroplanage Anti-Aging Serum and the same make Anti-Planage Serum for the Eyes. So I thought we'd try this. It's quite a saga about this actually because I saw it advertised and again and again and then thought right I'm going to order that so it was a um, free trial and I thought okay that's even better you just pay for the postage okay just rubbing it in and this is where you have to put it all around the lines and across there and So you have to give in your um, your bank details for the postage, which I didn't have a problem with. I'll give this a shake. And this is the eye serum. Oh, right, okay. Comes out in a bit of a blob. Can you see that? Right. And I thought it's worth a try. Anyway, it didn't arrive. And then a few weeks later, I remembered about it. And I thought, hang on a sec. Spoke to the bank about it. And they said, oh, you've got to go on and threaten them with this and threaten them with that. Anyway, I finally found the, the number. Got on to someone. And uh, we are based in the United States of America. And I thought, OK, right, OK, what part? Oh, it's a place called... Boston. I don't know if you've heard about it. I said, yes, I've heard of Boston. So I explained that I'd sent for it, I'd sent the money for it, and how um, I was waiting for it to arrive, and it's a 14-day free um, trial. She told me, she said, oh, well, if it doesn't arrive, madam, in the next 36 hours, give us a call back, which I thought, all right, fine. Anyway, as it happened, it arrived the next day, and it actually said on the invoice that it was dispatched 18 days after the uh, order was placed and since it's a 14 day trial and it wasn't sent out till 18 days later and then it took like a week to get here I was a bit miffed about that so anyway cut a long story short I've got the product and I actually got my money back because I kicked up such a fuss anyway that's the way to do it so put this on and you have to wait till it dries so I'm going to accelerate it with my little fan look like my little fan. I blinged it. Look, blink, blink, blink. Right, hurry up a bit. Okay. Right. Now I'm not sure if that's worked or not. Time will tell. Okay, so now I'll go ahead with my products. The um, BB cream. Shall I wear the BB cream today? Yes, I will. Right. Okay, here we go. Pat it on the fingers. Warm it up a bit. Touch. Burn. I'm holding my he head up to keep my hair out of my face. I'll just clip it up in a sec. I'll clean my hands and clip it up Hang on. I've got my ma magic wand already warming up for action all right okay now um, I won't use the, any other eye cream today because I have used this miracle one We'll see how much of a miracle it is. I'm not sure. Okay, I'm going to use this one today, the Maybelline Fair Concealer. And it's already got its little applicator. So use it also as a eyelid primer. I must say I quite like this. You bring it right down. And it takes away the redness. 
and in there the hollows not nice and I'll put a bit around there as well and a little magic brush well Oh, okay, kick Okay, powder. Right. Trusty Chanel number two. Okay. Eyes. I was going to try this one today. This um, the one I got, if you remember, an Argos eyeshadows. Okay, so today, nice, quite a nice palette, nice selection. I shall use this brush and oh, and I'll try this one, sh oh, champagne. Why do I always seem to veer towards champagne? I have no idea. Right. Well, that's quite a nice application. I remember years ago when my children were young, um, my daughter was about six or seven, and I was due to get a new car. And I said, she said, oh, mommy, what colour is it? I said, actually, it's a champagne colour, Lisa. And she said, oh, oh, lovely, I hope it's pink. And I thought, how does a seven-year-old know about pink champagne? Anyway, it wasn't pink. But it was a lovely colour of champagne. This one, and I'm going to do the, I'm going to go to this, um, what's this one called? Blanc. The white. Oh. Yeah, that's quite nice. The contouring one, the, um, this one transition, will be, which one shall I go for? I think I might go for caramel. Let's see, a bit different today. Oh, that's nice. Yep, that's quite nice. Just take a different brush, this little beauty, and I might just go for a slightly deeper one. This um, cinnamon in the inside corner. Take it to the corner. Be a bit heavier, I think. I don't want to go too dark. I'm not brave about going very dark there. Now that's weird. Does that look even? Yes, it does, doesn't it? Right. Okay. Mascara. The 100% waterproof Rimmel. And I got my eyelashes lifted at Vicky Pink's the other day. Lifted and tinted. Although they're tinted, they're tinted from grey cream to black. Tinting doesn't thicken them, so you still have to put your mascara on to thicken them up. I tell you what, I've got a lot um, of debris come down from that eyeshadow. Well, still, it was Argos, not knocking any makes, but perhaps it's not been baked enough. And, or perhaps I'm just heavy handed, you know. So I shall clear all that off in a second. Oh, 
Oops. Let's have a look. I've got this big powder puff that I like to. Again, I've got two mirrors. Three. Oh, there's one over there that's completely out of focus because it's a, a times 15 or something like that. That's for real close up work. A bit in the bottom. Well, I don't know if that miracle cream has taken away my. Actually, it's not too bad, is it? No, not bad at all. Now, <laughs> having looked closer, I can see I'm completely lopsided. Look. So, top up. Which brush was it? This one. And it was a cinnamon, wasn't it? So. Of course, you shouldn't be doing this when your eyelashes are wet. Q-tip. white pencil. This one's getting that Q-tip again. Now, contouring. Next palette. My favourite next palette. Isn't it funny? I've got some new brushes and I still go back to my old one. I'm going to sweep it through this. Oh, we discussed this before about the colour. Now, look. Could you see? Can you trust me? I'm going to go a little bit darker today, I think. That's better. Than my big... Time to blend. Also, right. so this just round the jawline. And a bit across there. And the champagne coloured one again. I'm going to do a, a Sweep of both of those. Oh, 
Okay, so let's have a look at that. Just when you get this little brush here, go into this champagne coloured one again and just go inside. Now, lipstick. I'm going to try this one today. I quite like this. Hmm. A bit different. Let me know in your comments if you like that lipstick. I'm not sure. It is... What is it? It's... Why have I not got... Oh yeah. I have got glasses here. Let's have a look. It is called Jewel and it is made in the USA. That's no surprise. Is that L'Oreal? Look at the size of that writing. Can you see? Can you focus on that? Oh, it's Elizabeth Arden. It, that's a bit of a giveaway. It's written all the way around it. Elizabeth Arden. Okay. Now my hair. Just have a bit of a go at the hair now. Oh, look, it's turned itself off. Shows you how long it's been on for. Okay. I told you this turns itself off after an hour. But it's still warm because it's only just turned itself off. Okay, I've got to keep stop saying that. I've got to stop continually say that, don't I? Okay, and I shouldn't be. Let's have a look. Right now, I'll turn it off. Right, well I hope you like this video and I want to wish you Happy Easter and I hope you have got all the eggs and rabbits you want. Did I say that? I hope you get Or rabbits. Okay, bye. Hi, I'm back again. Well, it's a few hours since I put that cream on and it's actually looking like, you see, not too bad. But what I forgot to say was when it was um, being just... Um, spoke to the lady in Boston this has actually been distributed from Cyprus so it might even be um, Greek yogurt for all I know but hey I'll try it okay thanks a lot have a lovely day